So we got this new film coming up called Spiral, which is, uh, according to what's being said, it's a reimagining of Saw. Now, I'm a fan of Saw. I mean, I couldn't get past, I don't remember what Saw that was. I believe it was five, where to me, it started getting pretty over the top and it was a matter of just how much can we gross you know the, the people off you know how, how can we how much can we get them to really upchuck their food and all that stuff because it's like it went from being very clever the way uh jigsaw you know set them up had them you know pretty much fight for their lives in order to get out of the situation that they were in, you know, finding keys and how to get them out, you know, sometimes through their, their heads, their eyes or bodies, whatever, you know what I mean? So many different ways. And then like, as the series going on, I think it started really turning for the worse when after three, where it just started, it was just like, you just wanted to outgross the previous one, you know? I'm not talking out gross, like how much money you could, they can make. I'm talking about, you know, the stunts and all that stuff to where the filmmakers and the people that created all those uh, prosthetic, you know, things. And, you know, you know, it was just like, to me, I, it, I just lost total interest because it was like, you know, I mean, this is not what the movie's about. It's about you know, trying to survive this crazed maniac that likes to play games with people, you know, and makes them try to survive the most horrific, you know, circumstances, you know? And it all was just a bunch, it was just like a, a gore fest. And not that I'm against it, but it's like, it just didn't work for me when it came to Saw, you know? So I just lost interest. I don't I didn't even see the last number of them. I don't know how many... You know more they were because I just lost interest. I believe it went up to seven, and I think they had a, a, a like a, a reboot or something. I think wasn't there something about Jigsaw? It was called Jigsaw, right? This one's called Spiral, and it's a teaser trailer. And from the thumbnail, I seen Chris Rock, and I read also that uh, Samuel Jackson's in it. So uh, we'll see what it's all about. And uh, why don't you join me and uh, let's check this uh, trailer out. Okay, here we go. Emma, this is my son Charlie. It's Chris. Joy well at last. Well at last. Nothing happier than the wife of a new detective. Emma's cool, man. She's different. You don't know my wife. You give a woman 600 Tuesdays. It ain't worth three Saturday nights. How much money you got in a lot? How many problems you got in a lot? How many people you got in a lot? All of them were in the officer down. Detective Banks and Rock. This is where it begins. Ooh, Chris Rock is producing this, huh? Whoever did this has another motive. You're targeting cops. This shit's gonna go sideways fast. Sue's out there pulling all strings. Play games, motherfucker. 
Oh boy. Life can't wait. It's time to. You know, to me, that really, uh, it's interesting. You know, I mean, yeah, Chris Walk is uh, executive producing this. And we see uh, Chris Rock and uh, Samuel L. Jackson. In this together. Of course, you know, Samuel L. Jackson has to give the proverbial line, uh, motherfucker, you know, how he always says that word, always has to say that line that has something to do, that sounds just the same every time. I think the only time he's ever done, he's, he's never done that was in a, a Marvel film as uh, Nick Fury. But we see the, uh, the visual of him at the end, Chris Rock, you know, handcuffed to a, you know, to a, what do you call that? I would say heater, but uh, it's almost like how it was with, um, who was that, with uh, Carrie Elvis, right, in the original song. We saw him handcuffed to a uh, thing as well, you know, a heating unit, whatever you want to call that. You know, I don't know what to say, you know, didn't really get anything out of me. You know, I'm like going, okay. You know, it's a reimagining, but is it going to be the same story? But a different title, different uh, setting. Apparently, you know, the person's targeting cops. Um, I don't know. It's a teaser. So usually in teasers, you don't get much, which is how it should be. It's a teaser. I get, I, I get really fucking annoyed when people go, is that it? Oh, come on, you know, like this. And I'm going, what else do you fucking expect? It's a teaser. You know, that's why I think that's the reason why teasers now are like two minutes long because you get people bitching and complaining about the fact that it was only 30 seconds. It's a teaser. You know, that's what a teaser is, people. But anyway, uh, pretty underwhelmed, you know. I, I don't know. I got to see another trailer. Uh, I, I can appreciate that they're trying to reimagine in this thing because I think I definitely feel like it lost, um, the saw definitely lost its way and lost its momentum. Then they had to redo a thing with Jigsaw. I, I believe that was like a, 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 it was a, what do you call it? It was like um, a prequel kind of thing where it goes back, you know, before the whole thing of the events of, uh, of, of Saw. So, yeah, anyways, you know, okay, that's whatever, you know, I mean, if this is what, they want to do, you know, hey, you can't stop Hollywood from always rehashing shit. But anyway, that's my review and my reaction to the Spiral teaser trailer starring Chris Rock and Sam Jackson. And for those of you who stopped by and checked out this video, I appreciate it. And in closing, and as always, take care.